So this question is a diagram question. I say that about any question that provides some visual input. So this bar graph is the visual input that leads me to calling this a diagram question. The information here says that the bar graph shown summarizes the total number of businesses in thousands and the total number of tourism related businesses in thousands in Iceland for each of seven years. So whenever I see a graph, um, a table, I like to use, or most times, or some of the time, I like to use a method that I call the pinpoint method, which in this case would be, um, let's just look at a certain year and see if I can understand what the bars in that year represent. So the light gray bar represents tourism related businesses. Because we're dealing with thousands, then it's not actually 0 0.46 businesses, right? It's 0 0.46 times 1,000, which is 460. So there are 460 tourism related businesses and total number of businesses will be 1.9 times 1,000, which is 1,900. So that gives me the confidence that I understand how to read this graph. Now I go to question 22. It says in 2008, so I'm gonna focus my attention here on what's happening in 2008. So in 2008, what percentage of the total businesses in, and I'm sorry, I, it should be I-N, I cut that off a little bit, of the total businesses in Iceland were tourism related. So percentage, right, is part over whole times 100. That gets you a percent. So what's the part that we care about? It's the, um, in fact, this question, first of all, gives us the whole, right, the total number of businesses in Iceland. So we know that our denominator was going to be total number of businesses, we know what that is, and I'll just go right to left. We know that in 2008, the total number of businesses is reflected by this 2.6. We know that that 2.6 is actually to be multiplied by 1,000. So we get total number of businesses as 2,600 for our denominator. And then we're looking for tourism-related businesses. Well, that's where the 0 0.52, that's the part of the whole that we care about. So the 0 0.52 represents the tourism-related businesses. So again, I just multiply that by 1,000 as well, and I get 520. So you get 520 on top of there. And we can then go to our calculator and say, well, what is 520 divided by 2,600? I get 0 0.2. Last step is to multiply that by 100. So 0 0.2 times 100 is equal to 20%. And therefore, the correct answer here is choice 